Welcome to the vibrant city of Hong Kong. I'm here to discover its booming art and cultural scene. Hong Kong's new cultural district is a massive for art enthusiasts. Built on reclaimed land in Victoria Harbour, and stretching across 40 hectares, it is one of the largest and most ambitious cultural projects in the world. The Situ Centre is its gateway to the district and the stunning new home for Cantonese opera. A stage curtain-like entrance entices the audience to enjoy the exceptional design and the Situ opera's rich heritage. A thrilling Asian spectacle rooted in popular culture. It is a colorful theatrical performance of historical legends. Training is very demanding. It is sung in striking high falsetto. I won't try that, but maybe can learn a few steps. What are you going to show me? <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Characters create distinctive facial gestures to express their emotions. Unlike Western opera, talent learns makeup techniques to do it themselves. <laughs> Chinese opera comes from the Ming Dynasty. It was listed as UNESCO Intangible Cultural Heritage of Humanity in 2009. Tourists and locals flock to the new district of dazzling buildings to be spoiled by the cultural offerings. Asia-Pacific is a leading force in the global art trend. Easy travel, world-class infrastructure and free port for art work makes Hong Kong a strategic must for any art business. The Global Action News Philips, based here since 2015, made a move to expand its footprint in the region. We visited its brand new Asia headquarters designed by Erzog and the Mailroom. We've chosen to be here in West Kowloon, uh, which is without question one of the leading cultural um, districts in the world. With the M Plus Museum literally just 10 metres across the way, the Hong Kong Palace Museum here on our doorstep, because it adds beautiful synergies between the museum side and the a commercial side where you can walk out of a world-class museum show into our galleries and purchase art for sale. It's the first auctioneer in the city featuring a permanent gallery and a sales room. Fine art collectors will be able to attend year-round exhibitions, auctions and events. The artist has actually used the inside um, of it's um, like a envelopes, envelopes that which you yeah. get from the bank, security envelopes, to create this paper collage and it kind of looks like almost a mountain landscape. Yeah, it's great. 52,000 square meters and six floors to exhibit and trade the best of contemporary art. Hong Kong projects excitement among the vibrant Asian art community, blending contemporary architecture with the transformation of old heritage, like an old textile factory turned into an innovative creation center. The never-ending cultural offerings are cementing the city's reputation as a global art hub. <laughs>